In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to install the Creativo team. The team can be um, downloaded from your Mojo Marketplace account. So head on to your Mojo Marketplace account, My Purchases. I'm assuming you already uh, bought the team. So after, you, after the purchase is complete, you can uh, download the team uh, from your My Purchases uh, section. You should end up with um, creativo.zip file, which uh, we are going to use to install on our WordPress site. Um, forgot to mention that uh, the Creativo team is a team for WordPress, so in order for the team to function, you need to have WordPress installed. Right. In order to install the, the Creativo team, we need to log into our uh, WordPress dashboard. Enter uh, your uh, username and password. And now we need to go to Appearance and Teams. This is where all our teams uh, reside. And in order to install the new team, we need to click on Add New Team button. Click on Upload, because we are going to upload our uh, zip file we need to click on Browse and now you need to navigate to the creativo.zip file you should uh, already have downloaded from your Mojo Marketplace account select the file, click Open and click on Install Now after a few seconds you will see a confirmation message that the team was installed successfully click on Activate and now the team is active. You will also notice that um, as soon as the team has been activated, a message uh, tells you that this team requires the following plugin, plugins to function, which is the breadcrumb, breadcrumb, the layer slider, the revolution slider, and WordPress live chat. Uh, let's, let's click on begin installing these plugins. Um, normally, the site can the the team can function without this um, without any of this plugin, but these plugins are premium plugins. The layer slider revolution and the WordPress live chat, and I stro strongly recommend to use them. Okay, so I have selected the, all the plugins by clicking this button here, or you can manually select all the plugins, whichever it's uh, good for you. Click on install from the drop down box and apply. Okay, after a few seconds, you'll see that the plugins will uh, eventually be installed. And of course, a confirmation message, all plugins installed and activated successfully. Let's uh, return to the dashboard. And um, let's see how our, our site looks like now. Okay, I've opened this in a new tab. Everything was installed. Um, You'll see that the header is somehow missing, you can't see anything, uh, the footer as well. That is happening because um, the, team needs, uh, the team settings needs to be uh, saved at least once. So let's head on, head on to Appearance, Team Options. And just save all changes for the first time or click on uh, Option Reset. It's the same thing. Head back to your site, hit Refresh. And as you can see, our header appeared. We have a sample page button. And of course, the, the footer is, um, is available for us. Um, one more thing, I'm going to show you just how it is, it, it is to upload a logo because this uh, doesn't look very nice. Head back to your WordPress dashboard, go to Appearance, Team Options, uh, Logo and Favicon, click on the Logo Upload field, Upload button, Media Library. Now because uh, this is a blank installation of WordPress, we have no, uh, no actual images. So Let's click on Upload Files, select Files, go to Desktop, and I have my Logo Creative 
file here, which I'm going to use. You can use uh, your own uh, uh, logo. One small recommendation I can do is that uh, your logo should not be very uh, big. Try to make a small, decent, uh, still uh, pretty appealing logo like we have uh, done for our Creativo team. Select your file and save all changes. Options updated. Head back to your site, hit refresh, and as you can see, the, uh, the logo has been placed perfectly on our header. Right. Okay, so this concludes our first tutorial on how to properly install the Creativo team.